Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another video. Many women don't get why men are actually attracted to them. Yeah, I know that was a mouthful, right? And before I go further, I want to shout out Seba uh, BGS. Now, the reason I'm using the term Seba, that's actually a comedic term for a teacher of spiritual science. And that's originally why I started calling him Master Teacher anyway, because whether y'all realize it or not, he's dropping some Gnostic science on y'all. And for those who uh, are uh, a detractors of Seba BGS, to me, if you really have an issue, then you need to be able to discuss Gnosticism with him and, and to really go deep. And that's especially for some of the female trolls. Uh, you got an issue, hey, have that conversation with him. He'll put you in a hot seat if you want to go there on that subject. So anyway, Sebo BGS had did a video on, um, it was called um, Esoteric. The video's in there. It's not, the word, the exact title's not in front of me, but it's in the description box. The Esoteric uh, SMV. SMV value of uh, women, something like that. Uh, forgive me for not getting it right. Like I said, it's not right in front of me right now as I record. But anyway, that video inspired me. <laughs> I was like, you know what? I got, I got, uh, I got, uh, kind of put my two sets in. It's not so much about the video itself. Y'all need to go over there and uh, check it out right in the description box, right? But um, one thing, women. I think women know, but I think many women are very, um, have their head in the sand or they want to have a false belief. You have many women who quite frankly want to hustle backwards. They really believe if, you know, they get the education, you get a house, they get a car, um, they get some degrees, some job title, a man should be a, attracted to. And... Even in uh, cases uh, where some men, maybe some politician or something like a Barack Obama might get somebody like a Michelle Obama based on that political thing, you know, that political look. That is still, I can guarantee, that still wasn't the primary reason he got with it. Because if that was a political thing, he probably could have got with a lot of women. Right. And see, some women might think, well, she was an attorney and all that. It's like, no, no, no. And I think women lie to themselves about that because they realize the real truth. See, understand why a man is going to be attracted to a woman. It's a deeper thing. And it's really, it really is ironic. Many educated women don't seem to get something that that high school graduate in the hood but who works in a beauty salon understands perfectly or you know works in a nail shop and keeps her hair and nails done and keeps herself in a good shape men are primarily attracted to beauty they i mean the other stuff depending on their social culture you know yeah they're gonna look at it but if all things being equal even if a woman is an attorney or something, all things being equal, if the one's an attorney and she will rate it to a man as like a five and the other one's an attorney and she rates to a man as a nine, the man is going to take the nine. See, one thing um, BGS said in um, his video, right? He said, which is very important, men set the value of women. You know, and just like on the other hand, even though many men don't want to hear this, women really set the value of men. Right. See, in the case with women, men are the buyers. You know, they decide how much money they want to spend on or something or how much value they want to assign to some women are the sellers. Now, the women can come up and, you know, women can say, well, you know what? I got this degree. I'm, I'm making this amount of much of money and everything. But that don't mean you have to buy it. An analogy would be that house and maybe that's like run down and everything poor. But, you know, technically, a person could sell it. I mean, it could be run down. It could need like thousands of dollars of work. And, you know, a real estate agent can try to sell it for half a million. 
even though the neighborhood is bad. They can they can list it for half a million. But nobody's going to come. Nobody's going to buy it because ultimately, if you sell something, people have to want to buy it. So the issue is what will men buy? On a deep level, we are attracted to the beauty. We are attracted to a woman's youth. That's why it's like it's it shouldn't be like rocket science. But after reading several comments from women, seeing several videos, um, seeing a whole bunch of stuff, seeing women lie to themselves, thinking that a man is intimidated by their money or their position. You know, I'm just thinking either A, the women are lying to themselves or B, they lying to the men. But there's some lies in there going on. See, the man is not intimidated by it. We're just not attracted to it. Don't turn us on. I mean, we could like the person as a person and we can, you know, we can respect it. You know, might even want to do business with her. But a dicks ain't going to get hard. And that's the most important thing for a woman. That's the most important thing because uh, in Seba BGS's video, he, he talked about Oprah Winfrey. You know, for all her billions, for all she's done, her TV networks, you know, how much, I mean, shoot, she sent people to school. She could probably, heck, somebody even, it was even floated about her running for president in 2020. For all that stuff, her biggest concern is how physically attractive she looks because she knows. She knows for everything. <laughs> But see, a lot of a lot of women don't get that. And, you know, they'll get some guy, even though they'll have the car and stuff, and they'll think, oh, it's the car. It was like, no, nah, he just wants to use it. Or they'll think it's, well, I have this degree, or I'm so intelligent. It's like, no. He thinks you're attractive. Now, here's an interesting thing, though. That's beauty. Also, femininity comes in there. Receptive. You know, m many women don't get that if you want to get a man, you cannot be a man. You can't come and you can't like approach a man like the same way, you know, like you're a man yourself. And you get some women like that. Like you get a lot of women who call themselves alpha females, but they define themselves as alpha females in the same way men would define themselves as alpha males. They'll think, well, I'm going to take charge, you know, and I'm a leader and all of that. No. You know, remember, men are the buyers. We're setting the value. The alpha female to us is that very beautiful woman who has a cooperative personality and who's in her femininity. You know, so that's it. It is not. It is. It's amazing. It's not rocket science. Now, I'm. A, I'm going to talk about that cooperation part. Because there's an interesting thing, because you get some of these women, older women especially, or even unattractive women, and they'll say, well, I'm still doing all this. I'm still getting the guys and everything. But that comes down to one thing. You're easy. Yeah, you heard me say it. You're easy. A woman, look, when a lot of times you get some older women especially. And I've seen a lot of older women go for some young guy go for some young guy do that cougar thing they ain't always uh physically attractive or put together and they'll think well i'm getting these young guys or i'm getting these guys and everything that's because you're easy many men will go for low-hanging fruit because let me let me give y'all some raw game you know when i was younger one of the things i saw because i've dealt with some older women i used to deal with a lot of older women sometimes right I deal with some younger ones, but I deal with some older ones. I saw the older ones. You know what I saw? I saw easy. You know, she by herself or, you know, she tired. She got that big old home and everything. And I'll just be like, can I come over? Because you can, they, they easy to the point. You can get, you can just tell them, hey, this is what's up. You can go full mode one on an older woman easier than a younger one. Because what's she going to do? Especially if her beauty or whatever. She definitely don't have that youth part. You know, I ain't really talk about that. But that's a very important thing too. They stream probably the most important thing. Most men prefer a woman, you know, when she's younger. Because she's at the height of her beauty. That's when she's really an alpha. But, you know, you get that older woman. Even if she kept herself together, many men just thinking, you know what, she's going to be easy. 
I ain't gonna have any trouble. Boom. Because that's an aspect, that's an, that really is an aspect of the game. In fact, I'm gonna get into that whole dog's life thing. Because any, any true dog can see a dog different from a player. A way different. There's a big old difference. Uh, a dog is <laughs> something else. It's interesting nobody really talks about that mentality because it really is. It's, it's kind of a way of life. But let me not get too far off subject here. But women don't get that. You know? Women don't get that. So a lot of times, like if I would tell a woman if she really wanted guys or men in her life, and there's a lot of women out there, it was like, and I've actually told some women this, you know, yeah, you know, it's, it's cool that you got that professional thing. It's good you can have a conversation with a guy. But if you really want to attract him, you need to hit, hit that stair climber at the gym. You need to, like, do some walking, running, whatever. Do some cardio. Make sure your hair gets fixed. You know. Make sure your toes look nice. A lot of dudes out there, some serious, love some toes. Shoot. Make sure your ass look good in a sundress. You know, dress to compliment yourself. Have your have that beauty and have a, uh, and be, be able to smile. Because, see, a lot of women... You know, to get mad, you know, some guys on the streets tell them to smile and everything. It's like, okay, you don't have to do anything. But that woman who smiles actually gets more men than the one who doesn't. Now, I'm just saying. And, you know, it is, it, you know what, I'm going to tell you what. Women, this is why sometimes I, I'm not as sympathetic when women say they don't have anybody. Or they don't, you guys ain't approaching them or anything. A lot of times, it's, it's not that a man isn't approaching them. It's a lot of times, um, they, it's just not the man they want. Because a woman, look, think about it. A woman to really get a man, really just got to keep herself fixed up. She don't, she don't, that's the hardest work she got to do. Watch her weight. You know, work on any attitude so she's cooperative. Watch her diet so it don't mess her up. And be careful about the type of guy she let inside of her anyway so she don't get too much baggage. You know? It's, it's basically just work to keep yourself physically attractive. Seriously. Yeah, all, this, all this other stuff. You know, learn you know, learn how to be cooperative. All that stuff. Beauty is easier for a woman. Because really for a man. Because uh, Siba BGS also did a video for men. The reality is, I know we talk of men as men, we talk about gold diggers and all of that, but the reality is a man, you still got you still got to at least have a job. You still got to have some money coming in. You know. So it's like it, you know, you don't maybe maybe you don't have to be like as physically attractive, but a man got to at least be decent. You still got to work to keep a decent physique and all of that, or a decent body, or at least a decent enough for the women you want to get. You know, we still got to, uh, as men, shoot, we still got to have a level of intelligence, you know, and then at a deeper level, we still got to be, we still got to have enough of a mentality to lay out a body. So this is a lot of stuff men have to do, but women, it, it was actually easy. It Seriously, it's easy. I mean, shoot. You know, whatever you want to call that universal force out there, you know, God, um, you know, Buddha, Galactus, and you know it, the Great Pumpkin, it actually made it easy. That's why I look at women sometimes. I'm like, oh, you really don't have to do much. You only have to spend money, really. <laughs> a lot of times a woman should, if she really keep herself up. Shoot, use a bar of soap and keep a face washed sometimes with some guys. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, women need to just understand. Well, you know what? I still say, I think a lot, many women do, but I think many women are lying to themselves. And that's part of why I did this video, all right? Just to like put it out there. So anyway, that's it for today. Y'all have a great one. Peace.